Yo, what's going on, guys? Mr. NASCAR back at it again with another video. So, um, currently it's 4.15 p.m. What the heck? Okay, that's one's wrong. Okay, that was weird. Um, but I'm working on making my first stop motion track thingamabob for, you know, the NASCAR something cup series. I don't know what I'm going to call the series yet. I have no idea, but, uh, I'm working on the, the uh, the, uh, Whatever it's called, the the track. Yes, I'm working on the track because that's what I have so far. Um, that's not gonna be the final result at all. But um, what I'm gonna do until I get more better stuff to make tracks with, I'm gonna have to use this, like I showed you guys. It's an old Hot Wheels AI track. Uh, it does not. It's not very realistic whatsoever for 164 scale cars. It can fit eight wide, so. I have to come up with like some interesting track names because it don't have to be fictional. Because unless I did a road course, which wouldn't really work. But uh, what I want to do is I want to like go out to a store one day, get a crap ton of plywood and just freaking cut it, and then get some sort of spray paint and just make it look like an actual race track. And I can you know use that as track pieces, cut them the right length, and then get something out something for wall. I don't know what I'm gonna use for walls. Um, after like a couple years, dude, shout out to him. I guess I don't know why I'm doing shout outs, but anyway, shout out to him. He uh, did a video two years back. I watched it yet last night. Um, it was explaining how to make a stop motion track and whatever. I watched the video and I saw the walls that he used. They, they look really realistic. Um, especially when he puts, like, the white stuff on it. You should go watch his video, but, um, yeah, so, um, he, I don't, I forgot what it's called, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go look at it, but I'm probably gonna get that stuff, and then put that, put the walls, or I'll do his method and get just some masterpieces of cardboard, but, uh, yeah, so, for the first few races, I don't know if it's gonna be the first few, first few seasons, uh, the whole thing, the whole series, but, uh, it's gonna be a lot of right turns, unless there's another option, I can use some cardboard, I, I, I did some, I don't know if you can actually see that, but there's some cardboard in there, from when I did, you know, little races by myself, I don't want to stop motion, I just, you know, race cars by myself, but, um, I used cardboard tracks, because I thought it was, like, the, you know, the best thing ever, uh, it wasn't the best thing ever, but it worked, and the tracks looked decent. I didn't have walls, but I could make walls out of race cars because I mean that's that could work temporarily. So comment if I should use cardboard and cars as walls. I mean either way, I'm gonna use cars as walls because on here on this racetrack that doesn't look half bad at all. That looks pretty good if I use cars as walls. I don't know if I should be using cars. I mean, I don't know why I'm saying that. I'm going to be using cars as well as whatsoever. Just comment down below if I should use the AI track or the cardboard. Because the cardboard track, I can make it look more more realistic. The track looks like it's an actual real racetrack besides the track color. The track color would be brown, and that's the only issue. And then I, I have a garage I can use to, you know, put cars in that are damaged and stuff. But, uh, so yeah, I could do that. Um, so that's all I have for this video, just kind of telling you guys what, what the races are going to look like, and if I use that, which I'm going to, maybe, actually no, it's going to be a mixture of racetracks, I'm going to do cardboard for the first race, and it's going to be Daytona, because that's going to, that's what's going to have to be, I'm going to have to do Daytona, because, well, yeah, <laughs> I have to do Daytona for the first, I mean, that's just in my mind, because, you know, Daytona 500, NASCAR, it goes together, and, then, you know, I kind of have to do it. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I have a whole nice field of cars. The cars that I want to get are a, um, either a Matt Benedetto 2019 or a Christopher Bell 2020 whenever it comes out. A 95 Toyota, because I'm using Casey Kane's uh, 2018 Camaro. <laughs> For the Vine Family Racing, Christopher Bell. I need to get a Coil Joy Mustang and some front row motorsports cars and a 37, like Chris Busher's last year. Or if they release a Ryan Priest in this year, I need to get those. Other than that, I have a really, I have almost a complete field of drivers. But I want to make customs and, like, get, you know, underfunded teams like the 15, the double zero, um, 78, you know, 
all the Rickroy racing cars, those. I don't see myself doing that any like at near in the near future whatsoever. But what I might do to get the sixty six is wait until the Timmy Hill I Racing win comes out. I'm gonna buy that one because I mean they're making that as a die cast, I think. So I'll be getting that one and I'll be have like the sixty six, but whatever. So that's just a like, you know, quick video. I just you know, I mean it's not quick, it's five minutes long. But yeah, so I was just telling you guys what I'm gonna do. Again, stop motions are gonna be interesting until maybe season two, three, four. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the notifications because I would really appreciate it if you did that. We're almost at 20 subs, and we are legit one subscriber away last time I checked. So we might be there by now. I don't know. I haven't looked yet. But uh, thank you guys for watching, and remember, remember, comment down below if I... Actually, no, you don't have to comment anything. I mean, if you want to, you sure, go ahead and comment down stuff. Comment, like, Woo Na Yeah, comment Woo NASCAR. Yeah, do that. And I'll see you guys next time. So, yeah, bye.